So guys, for the first step, you're gonna head over to search and type in services, click on it. And then once you're on this, you're gonna scroll down till you find background intelligent transfer service, you're gonna double click on it. And then you're gonna change the startup type to automatic and then click on start. And then click on okay. Now you're gonna scroll down again until you find cryptographic services right here. You're gonna double click on it. Make sure the startup type is on automatic and then click on start which will then make the service status running and then click on OK. And now you want to click on any service once and then click on W on your keyboard. You want to scroll down until you find Windows Update. Do the same thing. Double click on it, startup type, automatic, and then make the service status running. So click on Start, which will make it running and then click on OK. And now for the second step, you want to head over to Search and type in CMD. Then you want to run it as administrator and then click on Yes. And then once you're on this, you're going to type in ipconfig space forward slash flush DNS. Click on enter. And then you want to type in netsh space winsock space reset. Click on enter again. And now you just want to restart your computer and then the problem should be fixed.